legs together or parallel so you can choose and then long and tall hmm beautiful Sunday morning let's do a nice inhale through the nose and then deep exhale through your mouth. And again, inhale, enjoy this breathing, and exhale, long arms. And again, inhale through the nose, and exhale, Ooh, give me one more time. Deep breath through the nose, in, feel your lungs with the air, and deep exhale out through the mouth. Good job. Let's go and warm neck and shoulders. So we start with circles, long arms. Today we will do quite some standing exercises with a chair. And we will do also the mat exercises. But expect a lot standing with a chair or sitting. Now let's go a little bit higher. Elbows high up in a circle. Perfect. This immediately boosts circulation through the neck. Very nice. Now hold and let's return. So just your shoulders go forward. Straight and tall. And then we include the elbows. Woo, a little bit higher. Let's do four more. Three, two, and one that's perfect you can shake your arms a little bit and now let's make a fist so fist and open just your hands long fingers and then fist and we go to the side fist open fist open now let's go higher fist and open just your hands like we're pumping the blood with the hands just down and again just fist open four three to hold up now one arm goes back one arm stays up and one two so try with the arm back to lift and push as high as you can nice can we include the feet so we go up and up on your toes when you change the arms and push back push 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 eight seven six five four three two and one good job again both arms up continue up on your feet heels up good job now hold it like you want to touch something up on the ceiling only four more you feel your calves now warming nice good job now open the legs in the width of the hips and now we stay here we do one elbow down and then you stretch the other arm up and change doing a little side stretch opening the lungs and then alternate one arm at a time kick up stretch and eight seven six five four three two and one good job now you push to me one arm back one fourth you do a little rotation here we go just like this one arm back, one in front, and then you can look a little bit back towards the arm. Give me four more. This is nice warming for the waist, for your back, chest and arms. Good job. All right, now shake your arms. Let's go and warm a little bit of waist and the legs. You open your legs a little bit wider, hands on your waist. And now we just go a little bit from left to the right. Very good, so just left and right, swinging the hips. And then, if you wish a little bit deeper, you can also go with the upper body. If not, just move the hips. So this is one option with the hips, or a little bit deeper, you're going down with your shoulders. One, two, three, and four. And now hold in the place, just your hips. Open the arms and move your hips from left to the right. So my head is not moving anymore, it's just down there. So you feel your waist, your obliques here, pushing the hips from the left to the right. Be gentle, listen to your body, so you can make it smaller or bigger. 
four more. One and two and three and four. Now hands behind the head. Now let's do a little circle with the hips. So upper body is not moving. I'm just, just moving the hips in around. Very good. You're trying to be tall and high. And then let's reverse. Again, very gentle all around. Left, right, front and back. Staying tall. Again, I'm not leaning forward. So I'm very, very tall through the spine. Two more. One and two. That's very nice. Now let's go from left to the right. Include your legs, hands behind the head. So you softly bend your knees. Not too much. Gently warming the knees and ankles. And then we are ready to start. Again, left and right. Left and right. Four, three, two, and one. Now give me those arms again. And then we do a little combination with side stretch. Bend the elbow down to the waist. The other arm up and stretch. Into the diagonal now. And eight, seven, six, five. Very good. Two, one. Now stretch the arms. Good job. Now step touch. Just foot next to the foot. Give me the hands. Flex them. Open. Make a fist. If you wish, you can move a little bit further away. Bigger step from left to the right. Four more. And one, two, three, and four. Ooh, now shake your arms down. Keep moving. Left and right. Arms following. All right, here we go. Now the whole body is getting warm. Foot to foot. Let's do four more times. And one, two, three, and four. Excellent. Now hands on the waist. Let's go a little bit deeper down. Just bending the knees. And then you shift left, shift right. If you find this difficult, so you need a little more support, you can have your hands above the knees. So this is one option, another one, hands on the waist. And just moving from left to the right. Give me four more. One, two, three, and four. Perfect, again, standing up. And then include your arms. So you bend one arm, and then the other one moves back. Kick back, kick back. Hop, hop. Nice. Give me four more. One, two, three, and four. Very good. Just out of place walking. Ready for the chair. So I will turn the chair just here behind me. And then you turn the back to the chair. So put the chair behind you. And then you keep walking, walking, and walking. Move your arms. Eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now push and return. Push. Long arms and then pull the elbows far back up and push and lift. Push, lift. Keep walking. Nice. Four more. One, two, three, and four. Now calm your legs, just your arms, and let's go in a little squat, like you want to sit on the chair and stand up. Go down and up. If this is too fast, you can go double time slower in your own pace. So I'm keeping a little tempo, but if you're too tired, please slow down. And down and up. Keep breathing. Exhale, inhale, and eight, seven, lift your elbows, push and lift, push and lift, four left, three, two, 
and one. Very good. Now stay down. We do a little ones. What you can also do is to come closer to the chair and hold your chair. This is another option to make it a bit lighter. If you can keep your arms in front, you will feel your legs very nicely. If you're tired, make a break, please. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now sit on your chair, stretch your arms. So you stretch the arms, go down, lift your arms, and then come up and up to the ceiling. Again, go down, exhale, come up, inhale, gently down, exhale, come up, long and tall. Two more, and come up, last time, and come up, very good. Now one arm moves back, Again, lift your booty off the chair. One arm back, one in front. Now stay here, try to change your arms. If this is too difficult, you can just sit on chair and move your arms. If you can, stay up with me and lift, lift. If you wish, you can go a little deep down, deep lift, dip, lift, dip, lift. Eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, and one. Again, sit on your chair. You're sitting a little bit more in front, so the back of your thighs are free. Now, if we do a little walk, arms in front of you, parallel with the floor, and you lift one foot at a time. Keep walking. One, two, three, and four. Again, your arms lift above the head, and now go down on the heels and toes. So I'm changing my feet on the heel, on the toe, heel, heel, toe, toe, one, two, three, four, hop, hop, and eight. Whew, the whole body is working, but is in a static position, only moving part, your feet. Four more, three, keep yourself strong, back is strong, very good. Now you try to change in the air. Both heels, both toes, down, up. If this is too much, you can hold your hands back on the chair and then change. Heels, toes, heels, toes, go. Eight, seven, and six. Try not to move the upper body, so it's really strong movement. The back is working hard. Give me two more times. And one, and two. That's perfect. Now keep walking, just walking. Whole foot on the floor and very soft touching down. Keep your arms in front. Very good. And now we pull back and stretch. Pull back and stretch. Four more. Three, two, and one. Now step down with your feet. Lift your seat again. So you're leaning a little bit forward. And now just your arms. Pull back and stretch. Pull back and stretch. For the breathing, you can do inhale and then exhale when you stretch. But you can also try the opposite. It will bring you completely to a different sensation. When you inhale with straight arms, you will fill the lungs, side of the lungs with the air. Inhale, give me two more times, one and two, that's perfect. And now again, up and stand, you sit and stand, eight more, one and two, the whole body's working, three and four, five, six, seven and eight, perfect, we sit on the chair. Here we go. And now you lift one knee off the floor. <sighs> Try to lift one leg off the floor. And now you do a little kick and lift. You go down towards the floor. If you wish, you can touch the floor with your heel. And then pull the knee back to the chest. <sighs> and breathe. <sighs> Arms still. For the moment, only leg is working. You can make it much lighter by lifting very little. Four, three, two, 
three, two, and one. Let's go to the other side, relax your arms. After this, we're going to open the hip flexors. Now they're getting very strong. Lift your knee, we change the side, and stretch, pull in, stretch, pull in. The back is straight, you're sitting long. Four more, three, two, and one. Beautiful, hands just back behind you, push the chair down, and try to come in front of the chair. So you're coming a little bit in front of the chair. Your weight is on your arms, so feet can easily walk. So the weight is on the arms. Push the chair down, and now we just try a little bit to lift and lower hips. So try to squeeze your booty, lift the hips, and then lower down, touch the chair. So if this doesn't work for you, just hold it for a few seconds and then sit back on the chair, wait for us. Four more, one, two, squeeze your seat. Woo, that's nice. Now squeeze the seat, stay up. Can we try to lift one foot at a time, a very soft lift, lift. Like you're walking, your weight is on the arms, Touching softly the floor. Give me four more. And two. And one. That's beautiful. Sit back on the chair. So now both legs together. I will turn to you. You see a little bit better. So both legs together. Open and close. Open and close. Now we'll open the arms as well. Here we go. We're now activating nicely here the side areas. Open and close. If you need a little support, you can hold your hands behind and do the same. Very good. Open, close. Just legs and then we do the arms. All right, let's go with the arms. The arms doing the opposite of the legs. Close the arms, open the legs, and then reverse. Try to focus on your upper body, which is very still. So the upper body is not moving back and forth. So it's very still at the place. Now give me the arms up and down. Touch the chair down, touch, lift. Keep breathing. And now let's try a little bit faster. If you don't want to keep doing the slow version, if you can, go with me, double time faster. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, good job. Whew, close your legs. Let's go again in front of the chair. So your hands pushing down, you're in front of the chair. Let's lift the hips a little bit, again. And then come back close to the chair. Let's try to bend the elbows, come up and down. This is for your triceps. This is the back of the arm. Very important for beautiful arms and strong arms. If you feel tired, please make a break because we do eight more. One, you can do it. Two, three, four left. One, two, three, and four. Let's go back on the chair. You can sit and now hands behind the head. Open your knees. Open knees and feet, and let's do a little twist from the left to the right, and left to the right. I'm changing the groups of muscles so you don't feel overwhelmed, because I'm, I will go back again to the triceps after this one. So this is a little break for your triceps, but you're strengthening your waist, your back muscles, twist, and back. Now I'm doing a little bit smoother from side to side. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Open the elbows. Now close the elbows. Go down towards your knees. Touch your knees with the elbows. 
and then stretch your arms, touch the floor. Both arms down, touch the floor. Look down below the chair. And with a control, roll up. Hands above the knees, stretch your back, open your chest. Very good. Close the feet in width of the hips. Hands pushing the chair down. Slip in front of the chair. Let's go for another session. Now we will try double time faster. So we will go just very quick deeps. Ready? We do 16 times. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Completely stretch your arms up. Seven, eight more. One, two, three, four. Very good. Five, six, seven, and eight. Woo! Sit back on the chair. Now you can a little bit stretch the arms. So you grab the opposite elbow, go to the side. And then go to the other side. Very nice. And then you can stand up. Very nice. Now turn to the chair. We do a little walking. Move your arms. Today a lot of standing exercises. Just at the end, we're going down to the mat. Very good. Now we will shape the booty area, the legs, and also strengthen the back. Very nice. Now come to your chair. Place your hands in the width of your shoulders on the chair, right? So on the seat of the chair, push the chair down. Put your heels below the hips. So this is too far away, so come a little bit closer. Here we go. Now, the belly is strong, and then you're trying to kick one leg only, back and forth. Kick, return. And you breathe, exhale, inhale. Stretch the knee and go back. This is great exercise for anyone who has knee problems. It's the best one because when you're kneeling, you're pressing on the knee. So this is a better option with a chair. And you kick back. What you're doing right now is the back of your leg, also your back muscles. And the abdominals are strong as well. So it depends how much you pull your belly up to the spine. So if you want to pull your belly back to the spine, you're engaging more abdominals. Four more, one, and two, and three, and four. Now hold the leg, we do double time, faster, high, up. If this is too intense, another option is to lower the leg and touch the floor. Now you should already feel not just this leg, but also the leg standing down on the floor. Both sides are working. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Ooh, good job. Now pull the knee in, stretch it back. Again, changing the group of muscles that you don't become too stiff. If you need a break, make it. Kick, in, out. In, four more, one, two, very good, three, and four, very nice. Now you can place the foot down, walk a little bit, let's go on the other side immediately, and then we again go with the first leg. Now, change your leg, and just up and down. Stretch the knee, keep breathing. And please be careful with your head. I want your neck in the line of the spine. What is happening? You want to look down to your leg. So keep your head up, kick and back, kick and back. Four more, three, two, and now hold the leg up. We do double time faster. Hips are parallel, shoulders are parallel to the floor. Strong and tall. Good job. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Now pull the knee to the chest. Go in and kick. In and out. This is for the strong booty, strong hips. And eight more. Seven. Six, five, very good, four, 
three, kick the leg long out, and nice. Now again, both feet down on the floor. Now we go to the side a little bit. Let's stand up. So I will turn the chair to the other side so I have a little bit higher support. And I will go a little bit into diagonal just to see you a little bit better. So hands in front of you, feet are together. And now we go to the lateral move. So one leg to the side, kick and return. And return, so it looks like this. I'm holding my chair. So one foot is on the floor and the other one is moving to the side. So be careful. If you have any issues with the hips, listen to your hips, make it smaller. If it works, if not, bend the knee and try this option. If you can, go long and kick, return. Very nice. Just four more and then we stay double time faster. Two more. One. And now hold up, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and now we're going to kick to the other side. So kick and kick, like a pendulum. So how it looks like is like this. So you cross the leg in front and then open to the side, right? You cross, open, and exhale, inhale. Four more. Three, two, and one. That's perfect. Now you can step a little bit. Let's go to the other side. So again, I'm changing the leg. And then you go kick and return. Again, every side is different. So if you feel clicks, something weird, bend your knee, make it small. And return. Kick. Four more. Three two and now we stay up let's do small up two three four five six seven eight more we can do it one two three four five six seven eight and now cross and open cross and open very very nice it's a great exercise to really improve the mobility in your hips Strengthen the hip areas. And of course, your legs and back and core working all the way. Four more. One, two, three, and four. Woo, good job. Now again, shake your legs. Excellent. I will just move my chair in front again. So I turn to the seat. And then you will walk back and walk forward. Walk back, walk forward. So if you want to make it a bit lighter, you don't walk too far. So Eleni, maybe you want to do very smaller steps. And for the rest of you, you can try to go further away. Further back. This is like a little elevated plank option. Very nice. Four more. Three. Two, and one. Now stay with the legs back. You go down and lift. Now try to move your hips back. Heels on the floor, stretch the arms. And then lift your heels, come forward. If you wish, you can go in a little snake. Inhale, and exhale, push away. And again, come forward. Be careful that your hands are really in the center of the chair. And go back. And again, come forward. Inhale. Head down. Exhale, move back. Inhale, come forward. Exhale. One more time. Inhale. And exhale. Good job. Come closer with your feet. And now we go to lift one knee to the side. So you go a little bit next to the shoulder. So you try to lift your knee like you want to reach your shoulder to the side and side and side. So it looks something like this when I turn to you. So lifting the knee to the shoulder. And eight, seven, six, five, 
four, three, two, and one. Perfect. Now, come a little bit closer. So now we have both hands in the center of the chair and you can lift one arm to the side. Again, I will a little bit rotate to you. So hands in the center, feet below the hips, and then you lift one arm to the side. Lift, lower. Now we're targeting your back muscles. So if you wish, you can also go in front of the chair, like a pendulum, cross and open, cross and open. Woo, very nice exercise for the back and opening the chest. So if you wish, you can do a little rotation, coming up and then in front of the chair down. Open, down, four more, three, two, and one. Oh, feels good. Let's go to the other side. So both hands in the center, and then arm to the side, and then touch the chair. Let's warm. First warming, open, touch, and then let's go for a pendulum. Open, and then in front of the chair, down. Open, inhale, exhale. Arm is heavy. Four more. Three, two, one. Very good. Now both hands on the seat, one hand in front. So if you have the back of the chair, so touch the back of the chair. Very good. Open your legs. So open your legs a bit wider than the chair. And then you lift the arm in front of you. Lift, lift. Ooh, your back muscles. If you wish a little bit more, you will go into the squat like you are sitting back and keep lifting. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now lift the arm above the chair and now you go back and forth like you're cutting the air. So you can do straight legs or bend knees. You can choose. Back muscles working great. Four more. Three. Cut. Return. Last time. Woo, good job. You can shake your shoulders a little bit. Let's go to the other side. So you stretch the arm and you touch the back of the chair, opening the legs. And then let's lift up and down. Lift, lower, up. If you wish harder, bend your knees like you're sitting and down and lift, down. Ooh, only four more. One and two, three. And let's cut through the air. Now lift the arm above the chair and then cut and return. Ooh, you can also follow your arm with your eyes back and forth four more three two one Woo. hold the arm down shake your shoulders and come up and then roll up tall very good now we're straight and tall i will turn the chair and look to you so you can also go on the side doesn't matter but you're standing on one side of the chair very nice. And now you will step in front. So you come towards me and then you return the outside leg. So the further leg from the chair, you go and return. You step forward and return. Just step and return. If you wish harder, you go completely down in a little squat and lift. And squat and lift. So you can go a little bit further back so you're not stretching the shoulder. So I'm a little bit, my arm is in front when I hold the chair. That's it. Be straight. Two more. One. And two. Now you stay here. Open the arm. Now hold the chair to the side. Try a little bit to open towards the chair. And return. Inhale. Exhale. One more. Inhale and exhale good job now the arm is in front you want to reach me stretch your legs 
Roll down. If possible, try to touch your toes. Touch your toes, head is down. Look at the back leg. Bend your knees first and then gently come up with bent knees and then stand. Return the leg. Let's go to the other side. So I'm just changing. So the arm is a little bit in front, so I have space when it's stuck in front to have my hand just in the level of the shoulder. So let's go. The outside leg, we step in front. If you wish, you go deep or you just tap and return. So you can choose deep, back, deep, and back. Again, four more. Three, two, and one. Very good. Let's stay in front. So you can bend your knees. Good job, open the arm. And now let's go to the side, inhale, and exhale. Inhale, and exhale. Four more, inhale, and exhale. So we're breathing with the side of the lungs here in the air, and exhale out. Two more times, inhale, and exhale. One more, inhale, and exhale, good job. Now stretch your legs, go down, try to touch your toes, head looking back for the foot. Bend your knees first, and then roll, roll. And when you stand up, stretch the knees, and then let's go down to the mat. So, we will sit on the mat with the chair in front of us. Here we go. So Eleni, you can do all the exercises sitting without placing feet on the chair. For the rest of you, you can do everything. Eleni, feet on the floor, sitting, doing all abdominal sitting. Ready? So, we all lay on the floor. Eleni will stay sitting, and then we lift feet on the chair. We do 100. Ready? Arms long. Head up, shoulder blades up, and pump. Inhale, three, four, five. Exhale, three, four, five. In through the nose. Exhale through your mouth. Eleni, you're doing the here. Inhale. Exhale. Here we go. Inhale. Exhale. In. Out. I'm counting for five. In, two, three, four, five. Exhale, three, four, five. In. Two more, exhale, and the last one, very good, hands behind head, hold it, now you try to come up and down, up and down, for the Alini, you're just coming a little bit forward and straight, forward and straight, go, up and down, up and down, Eight, seven, six. Try to lift your shoulder blades off the floor. Four more. Three, two, one, and hold. Very good. Again, arms parallel with the floor and pump. If you're very tired, you can lower your head on the floor and pump and pump. Very good. Now try to stretch one leg. For Elini, you're sitting down and stretch one leg down. Ready? And then change your legs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Change. Again, change. And change. Lower the head down on the floor. Keep pumping and change your legs. Again, switch. Arms working hard, switch. Two more, switch. Last time, switch. Woo, now both legs straight. Both legs straight, keep pumping with the arms. Pump, two, three, four. And again, one, two, three, four. 
Now arms above the head and down, parallel with the floor. Above the head and parallel. Alini, you're just sitting and down. Here we go, that's it. Just open and down. Again, open and down. Now we lift the arms and then let the upper body go down and lift. Legs are long, straight in the knees. Open, inhale, exhale. Two more. And down. Last one. And down. Very good. Now, scissors. Scissors for Eleni. You're just doing scissors with your arms, all right? Scissors, scissors. So imitate the legs with your arms. Pull, pull. Whoo. Try to reach the ankle and pull, pull, change now, double. And pull, two, three, four. And change, and change. Four more. One, two, three, and four. Hands behind head. Place your feet on the chair. We do a little twist from left to the right. That's it. Left to the right. We're on the floor doing like crisscross and twist from left to the right. Can we do a little bit smoother and faster? One, two, three, four. Turn to the left, turn to the right. Straight and long through the spine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Woo, brilliant. Lay down on the floor. Good job. Now stretching one leg again, straight up. Ready for little circles. Little circles. So Eleni, what you can do is just on the floor doing little circles, sitting hands behind you. All right, here we go. And four, three, two, and one. Reverse the circle, go back. Hips are very heavy, anchoring the hips and making beautiful circles with the foot. Two more, one, and two, perfect, let's change the leg. Go up, straight and tall, and go. Circle, and circle. If you wish, you can try to explore how big circle you can make, keeping hips down, parallel with the floor. Circle, circle. Give me four more this way. And one, and two, and three, and now reverse, go back. And one, and two, and three. Four more to go is one, and two, and three, and four. Brilliant. Let's come a little bit closer to the chair. You're on your elbows, so pull your elbows back. Here we go. And now, you want to get up on your hands, try it, and then you will try to push the chair down with your legs, so lift the hips and lower down. Again, push, lift, and lower down. If this is too difficult, so I lean your feet on the floor and you just lift and lower again. And lower, and try to lift and lower. If you wish a little bit more challenge, go higher, but you will feel quite a lot of contraction in your hamstrings and booty. And again, a little lift and down. Only two more. Lift and down last time. Lift and down. Let's go for the bridge. So lower down yourself on the floor and then hands next to you. Now place your feet a little bit more in front of the chair on the heels, push down the chair, and then a little bit lift the hips, not too far, just a little one, and then go down. And lift, and down. So you're pushing the chair downwards. If you push the chair away from you, it will slip away. So 
So push down with the heels. Again, up and down. This is amazing heel to seat connection. And lift and lower. Only two more. One. Woo, last time. Let's do a little stretch. Try to stretch the legs, flex your feet. Come a little bit closer if you can. And we do this one more time, but now a little bit faster. So heels pushing down the chair, knees above the hips. So try to come a little bit closer to the chair. So knees above the hips. Here we go, hands on the floor. Lift your hips, we do small in the air. One, two, three, four, five. Woo, it's burning. Seven and eight. Woo, lower down, a little break. We do eight more and then we're down. Shake your legs, shake your feet. And again, eight times. Just lift your hips, go eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and that's it. Whew, well done. Grab your legs, open the legs so you have space in front for your belly. Shake your feet. Here we go. Now, try to come up. So if you can with the chair, if not, move a little bit backwards and then sit. So with your feet, you hug the chair from the side. So your legs are on the side of the chair and you want with your feet to squeeze the chair in, activating the inner thighs. I'm squeezing the chair in with my legs. Straight arms, inhale through the nose, spine stretch forward, exhale, chin to the chest, nose to the navel, reach forward, try to go as far as you can. Lower back is on the wall, and then come up, build the spine, inhale, exhale, over the big ball, reach, 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 and come up, with inhale, the neck is the last one, exhale, neck is the first, chin to the chest, roll forward, and come up, inhale, very good. Now, relax your feet a little bit. Cross your hands on the shoulders. I'll just do a little twist from left to the right. <sighs> left to the right. And four, three, two, and one. Now open the arms. And now you want to twist on one side. And then with the hand, you want to reach the side of the chair. And then the head goes down. Look back for the arm. Push something backwards. And then gently come up. Let's go to the other side. So, the hand to the opposite side of the chair. Push the chair away from you. Look back for the arm. Reach down. Two, three. Come up and inhale. Twist. Down, two, three. Come up. Inhale. Exhale. Down, two, three. Inhale up. One more each side. Exhale, exhale, exhale. Come up. Inhale. And the last one. Down, two, three. Come up, perfect. Squeeze the chair. Imagine you want to really bring the legs of the chair together. So squeeze with your feet. Come up with your arms. Hands behind you, open the chest. Very good. Now close your feet, bend the knees, lift your seat. So, level one option is to just go down and lift seat. Level two option is again to lift one leg on the top of the chair. Ready? And then lift the other leg up again. And you go hop and lift. This is harder option. You can try it. If this is too hard, just go down and lift. Down and lift. Four more. One, two, three, and four. Let's change the side if you did the first option, you just continue four more. One, two, three, and four. <sighs> Sit down, legs on the floor. Now go a little bit further away, hands between the legs. Walk forward, if possible, try to reach the top of the chair. Flex your feet, stretch. And then hands on the floor first, and then walk up. Whew, very good. 
Let's go to the side. So just a little bit to the side and then you stand up. Perfect. Inhale through the nose. And exhale. I will turn the chair so I have the back of the chair here to me. So I'm a little bit higher. So go a little bit further from the chair and then lift the arm up. And then let's move the hips away from the chair. And you go down, open, inhale. Arm folding down, exhale. Come forward. And then from the center line, come up. And again, inhale. Arm down, exhale. From the center, come up gently. One more, inhale. And exhale. And from the center, up. Let's go to the other side. So again, I'm further away from the chair, so I have space, the arm is reaching the chair. Opposite arm up, inhale, reach to the side, exhale, rotation in front, from center, come up, two more, inhale, exhale, gently roll up, last one, inhale, and exhale, and come up. Last one, just turn the chair towards you. It's a little stretch for the hip flexor. So you will place one foot on the chair. Now hands down, next on the side. So you can a little bit jump backwards. Here we go. Now you move forward. So you want to open here, the hip flexor. And then you move back. And again, move forward and move back. If you can, you can stretch the leg in front and then forward and back. Two more. One and two. Now hold down, place your hands above the knees, above the knee, so both hands here. And now try to reach back with the heel, push the leg far away from you and come up tall. You will feel nice stretch here in front. And then lift your heel and again lower the heel. Lift and lower the leg back. Lift and lower last time. Very good. Now gently come down towards the knee, hands on the chair and very gently come forward with the back leg. And then Stand up, we're in the first position, let's change the legs. So both feet on the floor, the other leg in the middle of the chair, in the middle, hands on the side, and then very gently, very little jumps back. If you go further back, you feel better stretch. So if you wish, you can try. So we go back, and then we come down, down, and then move the heel back. And then you go down, down in front, and move back, Ooh, one, two, and open, two more, down, down, and the last one, very nice, now stay in front, and then both hands just above the knee, and then push the leg away, so you lift your body straight up, and then place the heel of the back leg on the floor, to try to pull the belly away from the leg, so you're high and tall. Now lift the heel, lower the heel, lift and lower. Try to have hips parallel, both looking forward. So both hips looking forward. Two more, one and two. Lower the heel, come down towards the leg, hands on the chair, come forward and then gently jump, 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 and then both feet on the floor, and come up straight and tall. You can turn to me. Ooh, you can a little bit shake your legs. You feel nice opening here. Inhale through the nose. You're long and tall, full of energy.